Say, man, who's that cat coming down the street? I don't know, but it sounds to me like that whiffing man with the bone. Sure having himself a ball. This is an exciting project to see all the students involved and uh, to kind of get a snapshot of, uh, of what we throw away on a day-to-day -day basis. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, probably seven or eight bins full of what we found is just paper that, again, it's easily recycled. You guys have a container for it already here at the school. And it's paper waste. It should be recycled automatically. In fact, when I first got here, there was like a huge trash can that's full of paper that's used up in the trash. And the mixed paper recycling is right next to it. So it's just, there's a lot of opportunities to take. But totally different composition of waste than what we saw at the junior high. Obviously, you got high school kids who are off campus eating lunch different places, not here. Um, so you see a lot of this, right? Uh, drinks and sodas and things that they're bringing from off campus or even buying here. But I mean, this was all in the garbage. So obviously, these plastic bottles, easily recycled, even stuff from McDonald's, number five, can be recycled. From lunch service, uh, these are clamshells. And most people just throw everything in them, throw them all in the trash, whereas this might be difficult, but a quick rinse or you know, just clean it out a little bit and it's easily a plastic recycling, just like a plastic bottle.